It's fun. Eighth grader Wilson Johnson is one of dozens of teens learning the ins and outs of computer technology. I like mainly the coding and like the learning different lifestyles. Alongside industry professionals, it's all a part of the new pilot program called Man Code Mentoring. A few employees from Microsoft um, just kind of noticed like, hey, there's not a lot of us in this field and what's something we can do. Wanda Arch is a program manager for the Phyllis Wheatley Community Center in North Minneapolis. But we're also at this reimagined state because what COVID did show us is that, yes, there is a digital divide. Arch says one of the architects of the Man Code Mentoring Program is from the Twin Cities. But due to COVID-19, the program evolved from in-person to an online conference spanning 12 weeks, providing free online sessions for young black males between the ages of 12 and 17. Because I'm active in my fraternity, which is Kappa Alpha Psi Fraternity Incorporated, St. Paul Meap alumni chapter, uh, we're already doing some volunteer work over at Phyllis Wheatley. And I was, I was working with Quandra and Tamiko as I was working with them. They mentioned man code and they mentioned what it was about. And I said, it sounds like something great for my son to be involved in. According to the International Game Developers Association, 81% of game developers worldwide identify as white while just 2% identify as black. Like you think you're just gaming, but you can be creating, you could be doing voiceover, you could be do doing the coding, and these are actual careers. While the program is still evolving, Arch says they're hoping to continue expanding it this year. In North Minneapolis, Charmaine Nero, Carol 11 News. Sessions are held on Saturdays and run through March 6th. Each participant will also receive an investment account incentive of 100 bucks. There's still rolling admission for those who want to join.